Hi, Goggle. What's up? Hi, Goggle. I was looking at the keys on this keyboard. I know the alphabet keys, the number keys, the space bar, and the enter key. But what are these other keys on the keyboard? Goggle, this keyboard has 104 keys on it. Tell me, which ones do you want to know about first? First, can you tell me what these arrow keys are for? These arrow keys are also called cursor control keys. Cursor? What's a cursor? <laughs> Wait a second. Well, the small blinking line that you see on the monitor is called the cursor. It shows the position of the next letter or number to be entered. The cursor control keys are used for moving the cursor on the monitor. So does that mean the arrows marked on the keys show the direction in which the cursor will move when those keys are pressed? Right, Goggle. Okay, now what does this key do? That is the backspace key. When you press this key, it erases anything typed on the left side of the cursor. Really? Can I try it on the computer? Sure, Goggle. Write C-O-M-P-P-U-T-E-R and then to correct the spelling, position the cursor after the first P and then use the backspace key to erase the extra P. Cool! Now, can you tell me about this key? That is the delete key. When pressed, the delete key erases anything typed on the right side of the cursor. So, if I need to correct the spelling of computer to computer, I just have to position the cursor after P and then use the delete key to erase P. Yes, Goggle, you are right. Try it out. It works, Toggle. Toggle, why does this key called caps lock? When the caps lock key is on, all the letters that are typed appear in capitals on the monitor. So, if I type the word mouse with the key on, will all its letters appear in capitals? Yes, Goggle. But when the caps lock key is off, the letters that are typed appear in small letters. Yes, Toggle. Look, I have typed the word printer after pressing the caps lock key again. And now, all its letters have appeared in lowercase. Toggle, there's another key here called num lock. What is it used for? When the num lock key is on, it helps you to use the number set on the right side of the keyboard. Just like the caps lock key, press it once to switch it on. Press it again to switch it off. What are these shift keys used for? The shift key is used along with other keys. There are two shift keys on a keyboard and both have the same function. When you want to type the upper symbol on any of the keys with two symbols, use the shift key. So, if I want to type the symbol plus, I have to press the shift key along with the key that has the symbol. Yes, Goggle. Got it, Toggle. Now, what does this tab key do? The tab key is used to move the cursor to the right by many spaces. Type your name and then press the tab key. See the cursor movement? Then type my name. Okay, now I get it. What about this ESC key? The ESC key is used to close a menu or a dialog box. It is present on the upper left corner of the keyboard. If you do not want to work with a given menu, say the start menu, 
Just press the ESC key and it will disappear. Cool Toggle, thanks for helping me with this keyboard. Welcome Goggle.